Hello, my name is Katherine Crutchfield, my candidate number 4028. Hi, my name is Jordan Bavnani, my candidate number is 4009 and I'm playing Queenie. And I'm playing Mary. take requests. Would you like? What have you got? I might. Bobby socks and the blue jeans? Not too to get married? Dixie cups? Chapel of love? The Ronnets? What's your favourite? Be my baby. So, are we sharing? You better believe it. I'm Mary. Where's your little lamb? I lost it. And who's this? Mrs. Farron. Mrs. who? Farron. After a neighbour who gave it to me, I've always slept with it. By the look of you, that's not the only one. I've got a steady boyfriend. Buy you all them love songs, did he? He likes to surprise me. You can say that again. I've got all the 45s and Ronnets. I hope they don't put one out while I'm still here. Could have been me this. Top of the hit parade. Can you sing? Matt of like you said I got what it takes, but then what I got, he took. Ugh. I'm Queenie. Are we allowed? No. What about Matron? You're not scared of the holy cow, are you? She might come up. So what if she does? I don't want to get into trouble. It's a bit late for that, Doc. Which are the great days in a girl's life? A hard question to answer, but you can be sure that on her greatest days, there'll be a boy in the picture somewhere. The actual onset of labour is probably governed by this endocrine section of the posterior part of the pituitary gland. First date is one of the milestones in a girl's life. Milestones? Today she stops being a child and becomes a woman. This is why the first date should be a happy affair. But it won't if you go all, all neurotic. Did you go neurotic? No, I went dancing. Me and Alfie went dancing, round and round the yard to the wireless. Jonathan took me to the palace on our first date. Is that where you met him? No, I used to sit behind him on the bus home from work. I couldn't take my eyes off the back of his head. Eventually he turned around and he walked me home and we never looked back. Saying goodnight to your date is left to your good taste and judgment and to the way you've been brought up. Mary, what's the weather look like? I heard we're due in for rain. In your doctor's book, Between You and Me, I've had shocking winds. <laughs> I can't stop spending a penny. It bears down on the bladder. Bears down? The uterus. Uterus? What? You what? <sighs> what the baby's in? Look. It's upside down. I think the head's somewhere here. The neck of the bag or the cervix is drawn up and soon this bag bursts. Bursts! The water flows no, What do you mean by bursts? Does it make a mess? There's all sorts comes out. Like what? Like pus and blood and Blood? There's nothing here on blood. Oh, I faint at the sight. There's bound to be a bit. But there's no mention in the book. There won't be much, right, Queenie? I can't do it if there's much. Get back to work. Suppose it's bound to when you think of it. What? Bleed. They don't cut you, do they? Not where you think. Well, how else is it supposed to come out? I think it sort of drops out. Where from? 
the same way it went in. A baby comes out of there. Ever heard of a camel through the eye of a needle? A whole baby? I think it sort of stretches, like putting on a sweater. So they don't cut you? No. Isn't that a relief? You never told me you had pipes. I don't. They sound all right to me. I couldn't even make the school choir. I couldn't make school in the end. I had to stop over at my mum's and help her out. I wish I could have been more like you. I wish I hadn't been so serious about it. But you came out with exams, though. They get you places they do. You're going places. Am I? Top of the hip parade, remember? I thought I had my ticket out once upon a time. I waited for the bus at the bus stop, but the bus never came. What are you on about? We're friends, aren't we? You know we are. So if I asked you a question, like, you tell the truth. And nothing but? All right, well, I'm asking. Can I sing? You just did. No, but can I sing good? Depends on what you mean by good. Like, Ronnie Spector. Queenie, no one sings like Ronnie. Imagine if she came in here, like right now. What would you say? I don't think that's very likely. Imagine she did. If she did, what would you say? I don't know, what would you? Take me with you. I don't care where you're going, just take me. <laughs> I fell in love with your music. That's what I would tell her. With Johnny? We had his flat to ourselves every Friday. Was he your first? Of course. Wasn't yours? Yeah, of course. I told my mom we went dancing. I know it was bad, but Queenie, it was good. Too good to last, hey? He came for me the night I was packing. My mom stopped him at the gate. I don't know what she said, but he left without saying a word. Mine said he'd stay by my side. Told me dad knocked him out. Not even a look through the window. Got down on one knee, he did. He was out at sea since he was 15. I dare say he wanted something to come home to. Why didn't he say yes? He'd only known me six weeks, and it would have worn off by the time he got back. You're acting like a kid. I'm growing up fast. There's no buses at this time of night. Then I'll walk. All the way home. Aren't you listening? I'm not going home. You're nine months gone. Where else can you go? Eastbourne. You get no further than the end of the lane. Are you trying to stop me? I'm telling you, kid, it's a dead end. I'll get through. And how are you going to get out the house? Make sure you locks all the doors at night. Then I'll break a window and run. Now will you stop asking me questions and help me pack up my singles? You're not taking them. Of course I am. You can't leave me here without them. Then come with me. We can sing them all day, every day if we want to. Say a miracle happens, we make it to the coast. Then what? We'll find a seaside flat, get jobs at a hotel, I on early shifts and you on late. And whoever stays home plays mom. Someone would stop us. No one will touch us if we pay our own way. Now. Nah. Why not? Because you'd bag a bloke and I'd be out on my ear. Who take on me and a kid? Besides Queenie, like you said, I'm a bad girl so I might as well act like one. Well, it's no fun being bad on your own, is it? Is that all you're taking? I'm carrying you, on. I? Al, give it here. You can start a career, form a group. The Queen X. Queenie and the Crown Jewels. I'll crown you in a minute. <laughs> it sticks. It's locked. Try the window. We're in the attic. There's an iron drain pipe. In your condition. She can't do this. She can do what she wants. So can we. Who told you that? Look, first thing in the morning, we're out. Of course we are. Queen. Just play something that will send us to sleep. How does she do that with her voice? Mary. How does she do 
that with her hair. I can't sing, can I? What sort of question is that? The kind you ask when the lights are out. Of course you can. Truth and nothing but. No. Thanks. Queen. Get in. I saw them live, you know, the Ronnets. The bloke I knew were mad on the stones and we were supporting. Queen? We were so close. I could have touched her. Something hurts. You what? It's all right. Has it gone? Yes. No, nope. something really hurts. What do you mean hurts? It's like a, a cramp, but worse. It's just excitement. Does it feel like excitement? Matron! It feels like... Nerves and excitement and It's coming! Are you sure? I don't know, I've never had one. Well, if it is, you've got ages. If it is, you'll be fine. I want to go home. Matron! She won't hear us. Doll's downstairs. She's gone to the sick room. You'll be okay. We'll just, we'll sit tight and we'll stay here till morning. You'll be fine. How would you know? Shut up. You shut up. You'll be fine. We'll just sit tight till morning. We're fine. It's nature. Mother did it. Ronnie did it. We'll do it. You won't hurt me, will you? You won't hurt me because you love me. You won't hurt me. You won't do anything to... Oh! <sighs> we'll go to hospital, then make our way to Eastbourne. We'll get a flat, start fresh. I've got ten pounds. Ten pounds in the post office. Ten pounds should get us started. Oh, mother! Packing in! Mother! <laughs> 